<coughs> Nicky Hawkins, that's on the London Standing West Ham Fan TV. Dean, that was a decent performance on the strength of things, mate. With what we had, Nicky, it was a good point. But again, if the board want to push on and deliver the promises they gave us, that's not a good enough lineup. We're playing six defenders plus the keeper, that's seven. We've got Kuyati in midfield, he's got he's unconscious with his bandage around his head, and you've got Joe Mario just signed. I mean, that's not good enough. Zabaleta centre mid. That's not West Ham. Mm. Come on now. And Zabaleta and Byram in the, in the same team. Crusher on the left because, because of Masawaku spitting. It's not good enough. We need bodies in. We really do. I get injuries happen to every club, but you've got to back up your squad. And our bench today, Nicky, with just kids and Joe Hart, that's why we didn't make a sub till five minutes ago. Yeah. I don't blame Moyes because who are you going to bring on? Well, to try and win that that's game? The, but that's the thing, very thin. And on the, as I said, on the strength of things, we conceded as well. I thought we was decent after that. I thought we created a few chances. I think we made the best of very little, to be honest. I think Moyes has done well. You know, we've gone behind a couple of times and we've come back and we haven't caved in as maybe we would have under the previous manager. You know, we, against West Brom, we came back and won. Today, we came back, probably should have won on the balance of things. But again, if we made some signings earlier in the window, I think we would have won quite easily today. I don't think Palace deserved to take the lead. The pen was stonewall. Um, Palace were very violent. Hernandez on another day should have scored today. Hernandez had a couple of, of chances, but... Today was about looking at where we are. Joe Mario looks like a very good player. Um, you know, a lot of people were a bit on track. Flashes, weren't they? Yeah. Yeah, but obviously he's unfit. The changing club, new league, and all that, adapting. I think he'll be a good player. And credit to the board for getting him to this club. But again, we need to spend some money now. He's on loan. We haven't spent a penny. There's one day left, and yeah. now we're going to be clutching at straws. That's what I'm worried about. Do you think we're going to get anyone in? I'm at the point where I take anyone. Yeah. We need bodies in. We need bodies in, and we need to spend some money because we see tonight Swansea won. It's all, it's all going to go to the final day. That's how tight it is down there. If Swansea can beat Arsenal, we should be beating Palace at home. You know, Swansea are, are rivals in this, in this relegation battle. We've really got to start picking up points against these lesser teams, Brighton and Watford. We've got to be looking at four points there, or even six. We've got to get these wins behind our belt so we're not, you know, March, April sweating still of the relegation zone. But with the resources we had, it was a good point. Um, you know, Noble really good today as well. That's, I think that's a, a good point. He scored a goal, obviously, but putting his body on the line. Byram, not a lot of game time, but did well today. But really lacking uh, sort of a, a heighty striker up front there to hold the ball up. Hernandez doesn't hold the ball up. Sort of missed Carroll, but God knows where he is and yeah. whatever's happened to him. But this is really about the ball, putting their finger out, spending some money and, and keeping the club in the league now.